More news is coming in. The High Court order says that Kolkata, in fact, uh, these are the details of what we have. The High Court has ordered Shah Jahan Sheikh to be handed over to the CBI. Accused Shah Jahan Sheikh to be handed over is what the Kolkata High Court has said. Shristi is getting us more details. Shristi, I understand the court has said the order was passed by High Court considering the gravity and seriousness of the facts and there should not be any delay in then handing over this man, Shah Jahan Sheikh, allegedly behind the Sandesh Kali Hara to the CBI. Well, yes, definitely, Sneha, the Calcutta High Court has very clearly directed the West Bengal State Police to hand over the custody of the main accused in the case, Sheikh Shah Jahan, to a CBI, as was also directed by the High Court yesterday. The High Court had yesterday clearly said that not only should the investigation be handed over to the CBI, the, all the case documents, but also custody of the main accused should be given to CBI by 4.30 p.m. yesterday. Now, today's order has definitely come as a big setback to the West Bengal government because we have seen multiple attempts on part of the state since yesterday uh, to, uh, to somehow get a stay on this order. We saw the state of West Bengal approach the Supreme Court yesterday also. Again, attempts were made to mention the matter today to somehow request the, uh, the court to hear the matter urgently. Uh, relying on the fact that they've approached the top court, they refused to give they refused, the state police there had refused to hand over Sheikh Shah Jah's custody to uh, CBI. Both CBI and ED today uh, 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 approached uh, the Calcutta High Court and said that all, uh, all this is being done by the state police to in a way slow down the investigation to ensure that CBI doesn't get to question Sheikh Shah Jah. The High Court has clearly noted that only because uh, a petition has been filed by the state before the Supreme Court that will not stop the High Court from directing that its order be complied with. High Court has also very clearly said that no stay order as of now has been granted by the Supreme Court in West Bengal's petition. In fact, state's petition has not even been listed before the court uh, for hearing as of now. Court has said that yesterday High Court had very categorically taken into consideration the gravity of the offences, the seriousness of the situation and had directed that Sheikh Shah Jahan, who's also a very influential person, part of the current ruling political dispensation in the state, uh, his custody be given uh, to uh, the CID. According to High Court, there was a reason that such clear directions mm -hmm. were given by the court yesterday and also a reason why very specifically court said that by 4.30 p.m. a time limit was set which is why the court has today directed West Bengal uh, okay. police to hand over the custody of Sheikh Shah Jahan to CBI and also set a time Implement limit the court order by 4.15 p.m. is what has been said but the TMC has been opposing this. No stay on the order by the Supreme Court of handing over this man Shah Jahan Sheikh to the CBI.